SureDog.com here with Ricardo the Bully Lamas, who's going to take on Jason Knight Saturday night at UFC 214 in Anaheim, California. Uh, Ricardo, how is training been for you? How are you feeling going into this battle? Training's been great. Uh, came out with, with no injuries, not even little ones that you'd expect from a training camp. And uh, feel good, ready for the fight. So you have a habit of sending away hype trains. You, you've done it with Eric Koch. You've done it with Dennis Bermudez. Um, yes, another one. Uh, so you've, you've definitely uh, formed a habit of derailing a lot of hype trains. So is this what you're predicting for uh, Saturday night? Yeah, definitely. You know, that's what I'm here for. It. I'm not going to be a stepping stone for anybody to build their name off of. So um, I'm ready to go. You know, I, I was taking this fight seriously. He asked me to take him seriously, so I took it even more serious. So uh, I'm ready to go, man, 100%. So the bully does what the bully does. Bullies out of win. Um, so you are going against, going against another, you know, really good grappler. Um, do you see this fight playing out uh, as a sort of a quasi wrestling match or do you think you're going to cancel each other out and, and get it in on the feet? No man, I, I think I could submit anybody in the world, you know. Charles Oliveira in my last fight, the dude is one of the best jiu-jitsu practitioners in the UFC and I submitted him in the second round. Um, I have a lot of confidence in my jiu-jitsu, I'm a black belt under Daniel Valverde and uh, I, I can go with any with anyone. Uh, the new reg weight regulations for California, has that been a uh, help or hindrance going into this fight? It's been normal for me. It's what I normally come in at and what I normally fight at uh, on fight night. So it's, it's the same.